Hello everybody and welcome to this uh, concepting video. I, I wrote down challenge, it's not a challenge per se, it's more of a exercise. So character creation exercise. And I'm going to draw and develop four characters here and uh, kind of go talk about what I what I'm thinking when I'm creating these characters. So for this, I was thinking simple shapes. First off, if you're creating characters, it's best to go simple shapes. Um, so if I wanted to have like reference up for this, I would probably have something like for this character specifically, um, World of Warcraft orcs or something. Uh, not necessarily the newer ones because they're getting a little more detailed, but the older ones, they were, you know, this big blocky simple shapes, but you had a silhouette and it was really good. Um, so stocky kind of characters. Um, so yeah, I kind of just had the idea. Okay, I want a big brute. I want to be stocky. And I want him to have a big cannon on his shoulder. That's basically what I did. I gave him an axe so he can kind of be like a throwaway grunt like character. Uh, character number two here is a very kind of a similar similar situation. I I have one concept with all three or all all these characters, and that is their involvement with a material that is green. Specifically, they get their power from this material or whatever their thing is. They get it from this material. Uh, so character one has this gigantic cannon and it, it's fueled by this green liquid. Uh, character two, he's, I don't want to do cannons again, but I have it so, uh, it's like fueling him. It's inside of his character and, uh, he gets his like speed from it or something. Uh, and it's, you can see like the little lines I have coming out of it, the back of his legs and the things on his shoulders, those are vents. So basically the pressure doesn't build up in him. Uh, the difference between character one and four, uh, which I'm drawing right now, is that they're the same, same race, same character, basically, except one is really strong and this carries this on his back. And he's, you know, he's physically strong, so he doesn't have to just rely on these cannons. He can use a weapon. And the other one is not physically strong. Uh, so the other one has these two cannons over his shoulder, and he carries the liquid in his hands because he can't keep it on his back. He does. He's not strong enough to do that. Uh, character three uh, is the leader of these characters and it's the only one that does not have any visible green stuff. Um, so I kind of have an idea that this character might be the creator of it or like can generate it or something or, you know, make it out of thin air. Uh, now I'm going through this a color phase, uh, just kind of wanting to get a feel for the type of characters and I'm pretty happy with this. Like I feel like this is a pretty good session of like concepting some character ideas. Uh, probably not how a concept artist would do this. But as I'm just kind of creating throwaway characters, they're not really going to be any important part in any story at this time and this is just like initial you know i had one idea characters powered by green goop that was my one idea and a general to control them um i come up with their random names and i add one of my old characters spotlight and make a little change on him but anyways uh, we're coming to a close. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, feel free to subscribe and uh, like the video, hit the bell. And if you enjoyed this type of video, comment down below. I am more than happy to just like this.